A servant of God, I am Robert Simon, beloved in Christ, loving greetings. Works of faith. When we believe in God, in His word, in His revealed attributes, others can see works of faith in us. With a simple example, I try to explain this concept. A farmer, a vivasai, a rikisan. He has paddy, the seed. He has to sow the paddy so that he can have the harvest. Now itself he cannot see the harvest, nor even visualize how many folds the yield would be. The process is long and the steps are many between the sowing and the reaping. He, however, believes there could be a good harvest. He should believe that there could be good rain, former rain and latter rain. He should believe there would be no natural calamity, etc. In this case, his faith may even fail him. His faith is mostly based on speculations and positive expectation. But he has to believe and act upon the faith. He has to sow the seed in the field. He has to trust that soil. If he doesn't act on his faith, his faith will remain dead. A vivasai depends on the laws of nature, whereas a visuasi depends on the laws of scriptures. When a believer believes on God, on his word, on his attributes, the believer acts on his faith. In this case, with all certainty and assurance, his faith will not fail him. Faith in God, His Word and His attributes is the evidence of things not seen and the assurance and confidence of things hoped for. One of the acts of faith is obedience to God, to His revealed Word, where the return are spoken. Noah believed and obeyed. Abraham believed and obeyed. Mary believed and yielded. Simon believed and cast his net. Man suffering of palsy and bedridden for 38 long years believed, got up, took his bed and walked. When we believe, we obey the Lord in baptism. Our intelligence suggests there is no magic power in water. Our reasoning knows when a pig is dipped into the water, a pup cannot come out. But Jesus said, Believe and be baptized. Obeying the Lord in baptism is one of the basic acts of faith. Obedience is one of the acts of faith. When one believes and is baptized in waters, what has happened in the spiritual reality? I, God willing, will continue in my next talk. Till then, God bless you. God be with you. I am yours, Robert Simon.